Witam Was w kolejnym odcinku. W 19 albo 20 już jest blisko. Taka dosyć okrągła liczba. To był ciekawy zakręt, nie powiem. I jedziemy do hotelu. Zrobić sobie spierdłuchę. Zabić kolejnego gościa z tego już niekoń niekończącego się łańcucha Mafii Markano. Dobra, chodź się. How did you manage to get to Tony DeRazio? I had bugs and wiretaps all over the damn place. When that weirdo left the Royal Hotel to deal with one of his men, I was listening. Yes, no cell. Tony, I didn't know you was calling. I'm just packing away your latest shipment. How long you been running this business, Joe? <laughs> I, I, I know, five, six years. Five years, three months, and 18 days. Well, this is turned. Look, I, I know I've been lied, but it ain't my fault. I've always placed a premium on maintaining order. If you let the rot set in, eventually it will take hold and destroy everything you've built. The only solution is to isolate it, eradicate it before it takes hold. You understand, Joe? Christ, Donnie, you gotta listen to me. Some nuts out there shooting the hell out of everything. You know how many of my men he killed? Yes. Oho. Rozumiem, że mamy nowego przywódcę. Dominic, is it? You will take the armored car and personally oversee the collection of all outstanding monies owed to us. Am I clear on this? Y yes, Mr. Razio. Once you have collected what is due, deliver it directly to me at the hotel. The code to the elevator is 0451. W takim stresie wątpię, żeby zapamiętał. From there, Lincoln had a couple of options. He could use the elevator code and go into the lobby, which meant shooting the hell out of the place. Or he could steal Dominic's car and go in quiet through the hotel's parking garage. When you're in the hotel, grab a couple of those little fancy soaps. <laughs> They won't give me any more at the motel. <laughs> Z drugiej strony moglibyśmy zrobić tak zwany wjazd kultowy. Byłoby to mocno w stylu kleja, żeby pokazać, że my tu tutaj nie przyszliśmy zwiedzać. Całą trójkę zdjąłem na raz. Siema do mnie. To jest opancerzony pojazd. I 
Nikt się nie skojarzy, czarny? Ja myślę, że taki skrupulatny gość, jakim jestem, że człowiek. Od razu mi się skumał, że coś tu śmierci. Ale dobra, nie, nie, to będzie się. Nie wyszedł? Sprawę to już by wiedzieli, no może że się dzieje. Oho, fajnie, że chociaż trafiłeś. It would be difficult not to. I've already taken the appropriate steps to address the situation. Believe me, things are well in hand. Well, they fucking better be. If this thing with the judge goes sideways, shit's gonna roll down well, here real fast. We haven't lost anything of any significance except for some men, and they can be replaced. In fact, they're the easiest thing to replace. Saul doesn't give two shits about any of those stupid fucks. All he cares about is the people that matter. Understand? I understand completely. And you have my word that all payments will continue as scheduled. None of our business associates need to concern themselves with our recent difficulties. Yeah? Okay. I'm counting on you here, Tony. Don't fuck this up. Goodbye. Nie spojrzał nawet? Nie sprawdził? Kurczę, no ja bym zerknął w tę kamerę, bo przynajmniej dał... Postawił gościa, który zbadał. Ale ja to ja. Wiecie. Idziecie czy zwiedzacie? Mam obsadę tutaj gościu. To muszę ci przyznać. Muszę sobie szukać. Musimy się tak ganiać? Czy dasz się zastrzelić? No daj. Nie to. Ja do niczego nie namawiam.
Wiecie kto strzelał Z tyłu w plecy Ktoś ma jeszcze jakieś przeciwko? Moje widzę się tutaj. To jest lokal w tym stylu. Skąd to odwiedział, że tu jestem? Czuję, że ten, ten, ten szef o to spadnie z okien. Tańczyłeś sobie? Czuję, że ci się podobał występ. You know how all this is gonna play out, don't you? <laughs> Did you? <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> Kill me. I'll be replaced tomorrow. <laughs> no one will even notice. <laughs> You're wrong. Everyone will notice. <laughs> No, tak myślałem. War on the streets of our fair city is a gunman stormed the Royal Hotel, killing an untold number of men. There was a loud crash, like a bomb going off. I looked up and there was a man falling from the top of the building. Then all these men showed up and every one of them had a gun. They ran into the Royal and that's when the shooting started. I still don't know how the hell Lincoln got out of that hotel. Aha, czyli my się dowiemy, jak tu co... No way, Tonus 
still alive. Hush. Whoever you are, you did real good getting up here. But Lehman's gonna be a different boy. Chyba jednak zejście nie będzie takie ciężkie. Winda? Od tej windy był jeszcze przystanek, tam niżej. Coś jest. Jakaś znajdźka. Przyda się. Nacisnąłem. No nic. Na spokojnie jeszcze raz. Weźmy to wyrzutnie może. Oh, 
for some backup. My pal Vito says y'all are some bad motherfuckers. Well, Vito ain't wrong. The saying he's very, very right. I got some time to give you a hand. Aha. So yours? No. No, you don't have any passage. Motherfucker, you look like the cat who ate the canary. This is our first step toward breaking Marcano and taking over the city. I hear what y'all got to say, but I decide who gets the turf, and in the end, my decision is final. Is this a goddamn joke? Uh, look, I know you knew you to call in the shots, but my guys are working that action as we speak. So where's the fucking question? From where I'm sitting, it looks like you already got a plan for this part of the city. This is the first I'm hearing no. of this shit. So I figure you got your plans worked out, but goddamn, you know how to get these white boys riled up. No, 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 no. I'm all for making a big statement right out of the gate. Oh, this one for Skeletta. About fucking time. Always knew you had a good head on your shoulders. I guess that's that. And make sure you don't fuck it up. Y'all can sit out the next one, because I'll be damned if it ain't coming to me. We're done for now. You'll hear from me if I need you. Nieźle, nieźle. Naprawdę fajnie. To było z hukiem. <coughs> Responsible for the massacre at the Royal Hotel. The suspect is described as six feet three inches and is believed. They're to be saying armed. you threw Tony off the roof of the Royal? Actually, it was through his penthouse window. You always had a flair for the dramatic. Tony's ledger. Last couple pages are pretty interesting. Any idea what US 5CJ means? Wait a minute. Holy shit. Why is Lou willing to calm 10 grand a month at a brothel and the same at a drug den? Based on what Greco told me in Scaletta, Marcano's laying out a bunch of money to get gambling legalized. And if that's what you're after, who better to have in your pocket? Than a judge on the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals, US 5CJ. Exactly. There have to be over 20 judges on that bench. Could be any one of them. The kind of man we're talking about isn't used to people getting into his business. I start visiting the places listed in that ledger, he'll panic. And go to Lou for help. And that's when we'll find out who he is. Keep that wiretap running. Never turn it off. No, nieźle. Także chcą sobie sędziego tutaj przygruwać. Pojedźmy na koniec do czulka. Nie mogę już kapu załatwić. Okay. To przejmie... Cassandra. No to tutaj, tak? Dzielnica francuska. Już w sumie dzielnicą francuską. No tak, to damy dla... Czy to jest... Nie, to jest inna, tak? Niż ta. On ma tutaj połączenie. Nie wiem, czy właśnie nie zrobić tak, żeby to było połączenie. Ale nie, to damy dla Berka, a tutaj zajmie to Cassandra. Tak to zrobimy, ale najpierw pojedziemy do, do ojca Jamesa i tą rozmową zakończymy ten odcinek.
Całkiem efektowna była ta walka. W końcu jakieś wyzwanie. A nie, to co? Prezentują mi zwykłe misje. Ale żeby nie było, nie ma co się tutaj zapędzać, to wrócą te misje te zwykłe. Tak, już nie wiem. I have to tell you why I became a priest. Because of what you saw during the war. That... That was a lie. I became a priest because of what I did during the war. What it turned me into. When I was over there, crammed together with all the other disposable Negroes. All the hurt... All the rage I'd accumulated over my life came boiling up, and once it was out... Well... You don't want to know. I doubt anyone's losing sleep over some dead Nazis. That's not the point. The men I killed... Killing them should have meant something to me. Should have had weight. But it didn't. And glimpsing what was buried down inside me, it, it, it was too much. I know who I am. I know you do, son. And that's what terrifies me. They say the good Lord only burdens us with what we can carry. But sometimes I wonder if that ain't a lie. Trochę ten wątek księżulka jest słaby, moim zdaniem. Ale taki głos rozsądku trochę. No nic, dobrze, w tym razie dziękuję wam bardzo. Trzymajcie się i do następnego. Hej.